The rise of Kuaishou's Kling AI model. Kuaishou, China's second largest short video platform, has unveiled its latest AI-driven innovation, the Kling AI model. This cutting-edge technology can transform text prompts into high-resolution video clips, extending up to two minutes in length with 1080p resolution. Designed to generate videos that closely mimic the real world or create imaginative scenes, Kling represents a significant leap in AI capabilities for Kuaishou, positioning it as a formidable competitor in the rapidly evolving AI landscape. Among the demonstration videos showcasing Kling's potential, a particularly striking example features a white cat driving through bustling city streets, navigating among towering skyscrapers and throngs of pedestrians. Another clip highlights a young Chinese boy enjoying a cheeseburger in a fast food restaurant, while yet another shows a child riding a bicycle through a garden, capturing the essence of changing seasons. These examples underline Kling's versatility and its ability to handle diverse scenarios and prompts. Kuaishou's investment in AI doesn't stop with Kling. The company has previously introduced the Kuaiyi large language model and the Kolos text-to-image model. Furthermore, an AI dancer feature allows users to upload photos and generate videos of characters dancing showcasing Kuaishou's ongoing commitment to integrating AI into its platform. With the planned launch of an image-to-video feature based on Kling's capabilities, Kuaishou continues to push the boundaries of what AI can achieve in content creation, Guangdong's AI ambitions and economic strategies. Guangdong province, an economic powerhouse in southern China, has rolled out an ambitious plan to bolster its AI industry. The provincial government announced 45 measures aimed at increasing the talent pool, enhancing chip supply, and integrating AI across various industries. The objective is to drive high-tech growth and ensure Guangdong remains at the forefront of China's AI development. The plan sets ambitious targets. By next year, the value of Guangdong's AI industry is expected to reach 300 billion yuan, rising to 440 billion yuan by 2027. To support these goals, the province aims to enhance its computing power to exceed 40 exaflops by next year and 60 exaflops by 2027. These targets align with China's national goal of achieving 300 exaflops in computing performance by 2025, with Guangdong contributing a significant portion of this capacity. Guangdong's strategy focuses on fostering high-quality development in its AI industry, building a modern industrial system and enhancing efficiency across sectors. The measures encompass the adoption of AI in social governance, the digital economy and industrial innovation. They also emphasize the development of a comprehensive AI industrial chain, from chip development and computational infrastructure to algorithm design and AI application deployment. The province's initiatives include efforts to boost the supply of core AI chip components, explore innovative chip designs, and expand the use of high-performance cloud servers. Talent cultivation and policy support are also key components of Guangdong's strategy, with the province aiming to attract top-tier AI talent and implement training programs to build a strong foundation of expertise. WeChat's AI Content Disclosure Policy. Tencent Holdings super app, WeChat, has introduced a new content moderation policy requiring all creators to disclose whether their posts are generated using artificial intelligence. This move comes in response to growing concerns about the potential for misinformation and the ethical implications of AI-generated content. By labeling AI-generated posts, WeChat aims to promote transparency and protect users from online abuse, scams and misinformation. The updated policy mandates that creators label any AI-generated content and describe whether the content is fictional. Additionally, when posting information related to current affairs, public policies or social events, users must disclose their sources, including authoritative media or professional entities. This measure aligns with broader industry efforts to enhance AIGC transparency and ensure responsible use of AI technology. WeChat's initiative is part of a larger trend among major social media platforms to implement similar measures. 
TikTok, for example, has automated the labeling of AI-generated content, while Douyin introduced tools for watermarking such content. These actions reflect a growing recognition of the need for clear disclosure of AI-generated material to maintain trust and integrity in digital content. In conjunction with these transparency efforts, Chinese authorities have intensified their regulatory focus on AI-generated content. The Cyberspace Administration of China has launched campaigns to clean up misleading AIGC, and new regulations have been introduced to govern the ethical and legal use of generative AI technologies. These measures are designed to balance the promotion of AI innovation with the need to safeguard against potential abuses and ensure compliance with legal standards. Economic Performance and Market Position of Kuaishu Kuaishu has reported robust financial results for the recent quarter, highlighting the company's strong market position and growth trajectory. The short video platform posted a net profit of 4.12 billion yuan, a significant turnaround from a net loss of 876 million yuan in the same period the previous year. Revenue also saw a notable increase, rising 17% year-on-year to 29.41 billion yuan, driven primarily by online marketing services and its burgeoning e-commerce business. One of the key factors contributing to Kuaishou's impressive performance is the substantial growth in its e-commerce segment. The company's total e-commerce gross merchandise value grew by 28% to 288.07 billion yuan during the quarter, reflecting the increasing integration of e-commerce capabilities within the platform. This growth underscores Kuaishou's strategic focus on expanding its revenue streams beyond traditional short video content, leveraging its large user base to drive sales and engagement. Kuaishou's daily active user base, nearly 400 million strong, makes it the second largest short video app in China, trailing only ByteDance's Douyin, which boasts over 600 million daily active users. This substantial user base provides Kuaishu with a significant competitive advantage, enabling it to attract advertisers and marketers seeking to reach a wide and engaged audience. The company's ongoing investment in AI technologies, including the development of the Kling AI model and other innovative features, further strengthens its market position. By continuously enhancing its platform's capabilities and offering unique AI-driven content creation tools, Kuaishou is well positioned to maintain its competitive edge and continue its growth momentum in the highly dynamic and competitive short video market. Kuaishou's AI-driven question and answer feature. Kuaishou is pioneering a new application of AI within the short video and live streaming industry with the introduction of a smart question and answer, Q&A feature. This innovative function leverages a large language model to offer intelligent text creation and responses. Users can input questions directly into the search bar within the Kuaishu app, and the AI provides detailed answers based on the query. This feature is currently undergoing internal testing and represents the first time a short video platform has integrated such advanced AI capabilities into its offerings. This development is part of Kuaishou's broader strategy to enhance user engagement and streamline content interaction through advanced AI tools. By making complex AI technologies accessible to everyday users, Kuaishou aims to lower the barriers to information and content creation, thereby enriching the user experience on its platform. The smart Q&A feature is expected to significantly enhance the way users interact with the app providing quick and accurate information in a seamless manner. Competitive AI landscape and strategic alliances. The competitive landscape of AI in China is heating up, with Kuaishu and other tech giants like Tencent making significant strides in advancing their AI models. Kuaishu's Kuaiyi large language model, LLM, has been touted to potentially match the capabilities of GPT-4 within the next six months. This ambitious goal underscores Kuaishou's commitment to pushing the boundaries of AI technology to maintain its competitive edge. Tencent, on the other hand, has been enhancing its Hunyuan LLM, which is now considered one of the world's best. Tencent has integrated this model into various enterprise products and uses it for daily tasks like coding, content generation, and improving advertisement effectiveness. 
These advancements are part of a broader trend among Chinese tech firms to catch up with and even surpass their global counterparts in AI capabilities. In addition to internal developments, Kuaishu and Tencent are also forming strategic alliances with academic institutions to further their AI research and application. For instance, Tencent has partnered with the Hong Kong University of Science and Technology and Tsinghua University to develop an innovative image-to-video model called Follow Your Click. This tool allows users to animate parts of an image using simple text prompts and mouse clicks, showcasing the practical applications of advanced AI in enhancing digital content. These collaborations highlight the symbiotic relationship between academia and industry in driving AI innovation. By leveraging the expertise and resources of leading educational institutions, companies like Kuaishu and Tencent are able to accelerate their AI development and bring cutting-edge technologies to market more quickly. Together, these efforts illustrate a rapidly evolving AI landscape in China, where fierce competition and strategic partnerships are fueling significant technological advancements. As Kuaishou continues to innovate with features like the Smart Q and A and advanced video generation models, it is well positioned to solidify its place as a leader in the AI-driven digital content space. Thank you for joining us on this insightful journey into the latest developments in AI technology and the impressive advancements by Kwashu and other major players in the industry. We hope you found the information valuable and engaging. If you enjoyed this video or learned something new, please give it a thumbs up. Your support helps us create more content that you love. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. We look forward to seeing you in the next video. Until then, stay curious and keep exploring the world of AI.